Yes, yes, yes. Welcome back to the Jeffrey Henderson Show, man. That was a sweet song, boy. I'm telling you, that was really touching. It was so touching. I had to take a break. <laughs> I had to take a break. That was just fantastic. The songs are, you guys know, are incredible. You guys hearing the same thing I'm hearing. Don't act like you don't. Man, it's just really, really amazing how a young lady can be 16 years old, but yet be so talented. And, uh, man... You hear it for yourself, man. This is just wonderful. So, again, we enjoyed that song. And we're just going to go ahead and move on to another one of her songs, too, as well. We're going to talk a little bit about that. Notice me. I kind of like that. It was just a little bit slower. And, and I'm, I'm really, you know, I'm a romantic type of guy. You know what I mean? And, and that notice me was just, just kind of got to me. I love them all, but that one right there kind of stuck and resonated in my soul and in my heart and in my spirit right there. So... Uh, Mom, talk to us a little bit about about that song. When you first heard it, how did that make you feel? Well, of course, as a mom, very very proud. Sure. But as and um, looking at her as an artist, that was I knew that was the song. You know, that's gonna put her on on the map. Um, because I think everybody loves anything that has to do with the love ballad, and um, everybody, as I said want to be noticed by somebody and I'm pretty sure there are so many people out there they have the same thoughts going through their mind and I think that speaks to everybody and um, as I said that I love that song that's my favorite song well, you know what I'm tired of you folks walking by me like I'm invisible man notice me <laughs> 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 I, I really <laughs> doubt it that nobody notices you, Jeffrey. That's an understatement. <laughs> you actually t have to tell people, stop noticing me. <laughs> no, I just love that. I just I love that. That man, that does something to me. Wow. Notice me. You know what I mean? It's, it's some of the most simplistic things that we look at and we overlook. Yeah. And, and, and you, now you're having a 16-year-old letting us know that we need to be noticed. Yes. You know what I mean? There's just so many words in the dictionary that we can describe this, this uh, CD right now on today. All the way from number one, two, and three. But that notice me, it just kind of like, man, I could talk the rest of the show out on that mm -hmm. right there by itself. Because simply, simply... You know, I'm going to move on because people be telling me, Jeffrey, don't talk about your life experiences <laughs> and don't talk about this and that. Sometimes you can't get around it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because it's real. So why they have reality shows? Because what? It's real. Yeah. Ain't no faking and shaking to this. And you got to tell people what it is. <laughs> Books tell me stick to the basics, man. It's hard to stick to the basics when you got a song like that by Molly Gibson entitled Notice Me. How can you stick to the basics? <laughs> you got to go outside the box on that right there. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't even be doing my job if I didn't pinpoint that and how it makes me feel. First of all, man, I, I got to feel it before anybody else can feel it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I have to notice it before anybody else can notice it. But anyway, I'm going to take you guys' advice, and I'm going to move on. Okay? We're going to keep it very professional, and we're just going to move on to the next song, which is number four. And which one is that going to be? <laughs> <laughs> okay, the number four song is called, that's again my favorite. All her songs are my favorite. She has four <laughs> songs. <laughs> you know, it's just her EP is out. The number one four song is called uh, Tailing Taylor. <laughs> and the story behind it is she had a crush on this guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait a minute! Right there, right there! Get the shotgun out. <laughs> and, and 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 the sweet thing about this song is she wrote it when she was twelve. You know. Wow. And um, actually, all these songs she wrote it when she was twelve and thirteen years old. Jeez. And 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 it's about the same guy which she had her huge crush on, and somehow <laughs> you know he never noticed her and. Um, and then he moved to Texas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> And that's a true story. <laughs> <laughs> so that's where the Texas song came yes. in. Oh, yes. Oh, man. 
and that's how she she writes. You know, she will just walk. She, just, she doesn't care. She will walk just to see him. Oh, hold on. Let yeah. me set this up. <laughs> All right. Number one is the guy moved to Texas. Yes. So she did a Texas song, which you heard with the number one song. Mm -hmm. Then after that, the number two song was what? what was that entitled? Couple seasons. Couple seasons. Yeah. Okay. All right, so I guess he left for a season. <laughs> All right, and then after he, I'm, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to fix this up. Mm -hmm. Then after he left for a season, then she came back again and said, "I want you to notice me." <laughs> okay. Now, now after you notice me, number four is which one? What is number four? And she wants to tell him how she feels okay. about him. All she right. wanted to tell him everything, but she couldn't, and so she wrote a song called "Telling Taylor." Oh my God, that is really, really nice. You know what? I'm glad that we we, we just sometimes you got to take time to take time. You know what I mean? And uh, I just didn't know how we was gonna do this show on today, but you know we're very spontaneous. You know anybody that knows Jeffrey Henderson, you know that's the way we do it each and every time because it's a lot funner that way. So I had no idea that we'd do all four. Cause I was saying two or three, mm -hmm. but this is just really sweet. Let's just do the last one there as well because I'm enjoying this to the utmost. Uh, you can't fake enjoyment. You know what I mean? You can't fake happiness. No. Either you're happy or you're not. Yes. And I'm always happy. I'm happy when I'm sad. Wow. <laughs> because sad just don't do nothing for me. Yeah. It don't help me. <laughs> <laughs> it don't help me. <laughs> I just don't know what it is to be sad. It just don't help me. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But being being happy and, and with a lot of joy, a lot of passion and mm -hmm. and kindness, you know, love, you know what I mean? That's mm -hmm. what life essentially is. You know, of course it ain't gonna always go our way. That's all right, so what? But just to be happy. Just to be get up in the morning and be happy, man. This is what life's all about mm -hmm. for me. So and it should be that way for you. Okay. So now let's get to number four. I'm trying to get back to the basics. <laughs> Which is very hard for me to do. <laughs> Somebody said, can you talk the whole show? Man, I could talk this whole show with no music at all. <laughs> but anyway, I'm having such a great time here. And uh, you've been hearing some really good music by Molly Gibson. You know, and I'm, I'm just really elated. I'm just kind of shocked. I heard them all, but I just, mm -hmm. it seems like it... I'm hearing it differently with the headsets on and in the studio doing it for real instead of just hearing it in your car. Because with the cans, the headsets on, it's just a different sound. It really is. It, it, it's like the words just like jump out at you and, and really you really pay attention to that. So so we, we're catching it, you know, a lot more liver than perhaps everybody's listening to it over the, over the radio. We're, we're, we're catching it like ten times better sound, better quality than, than you guys mm -hmm. are catching it. So, but anyway, this is the Jeffrey Henderson Show. It is 3.37 p.m. That's how we do it on the Jeffrey Henderson Show. So, we're just going to slide on to number four. And, uh, again, what's the name of the song again? It's called Telling Taylor. Telling, say it again? Telling. Telling Taylor. Okay, mm -hmm. Telling Taylor. I had to get that right. <laughs> I heard what you said, but I just couldn't get it right. So, Telling Taylor. Yes. Yeah, all right. Here we go. That's all we do it on Jeffrey Henderson show, boy. We gonna <laughs> This is totally amazing. Here it is.
Oh man, welcome back to the <laughs> You guys just wait right there. I'm gonna be right back because I got something to say about that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be telling Taylor something myself. <laughs> so anyway, you just heard the song entitled Telling Taylor by Molly Gibson. Stay with us. We'll be right back. <laughs> 